What's going on, friends? My name is M2 Dreads, and welcome back to another episode of Paper Mario Color Splash for the Nintendo Wii U. In the last part, we, um... What did we do last time? It's been a while since I've recorded this game. Uh, from the looks of it, I think we got our second paint star from Mondo Woods. And uh, that actually led us to a new path here, which is uh, Dark Blue Inn. So, I guess in this part we're going to take on the Dark Blue Inn. So, without further ado, let's go! Okay, well, uh, so Dark Blue Inn is, um, it has a very, uh, interesting gimmick to it, and you'll see what it is when we, uh, head inside. There's a dead body right here. Thanks for saving Mario, I got jumped by a bunch of shy guys out of nowhere and I just broke down and started crying. One of, one of these days I'll toughen up and become a toad who stands up for himself. And there he goes. Alright, well. Um, we have a really mysterious looking building. I bet this is like some sort of ghostly themed place or, so or something. I don't know. But we're going inside. Oh, of course, the world-famous VIP shows up now. I am the world-famous VIP? Well... The hotel is closed indefinitely. We've had some bizarre occurrences as of late. We're really in no state to welcome guests. Another silent phone call? That doesn't sound natural. A strange force at work. I called Luigi because paranormal, paranormal activity is kind of his thing, but it went straight to voicemail. Do you think maybe you could poke around and find what's causing all, all of this? I beg of you. Hmm. Paranormal activity like ghosts and junk. I don't know if that type of stuff would do is paint stars, but sure, we'll go with it. <laughs> we should get business cards. Alright, so, um... So we gotta explore this hotel to figure out what is going on in this hotel as to what's causing all of this, uh, crazy stuff. Oh my goodness! Did you see all those books fly out of that bookshelf right there? Oh yeah, for sure. Wait, I I'm feeling something. The paint revealed a ghostly presence. No way! Apparently Mario is scared. So even Mario gets scared. I don't know, I've never seen Mario get scared before. It's not Mario-like at all. Where did that book go? I've been tearing this place apart trying to find it. For some reason, this book here is way heavier than the others, and I can't seem to move it. Hmm. What about- what- what does this guy have to say here? No matter how many times I pick up the books, they just get thrown from the shelves again. Am I doomed to pick these books over and over for the rest of my life? I don't know, man. Sounds like a- sounds like a really terrible fate to have. I'm the housekeeping manager, I've been doing this job for so long, I can sense when a room needs to be cleaned. But I noticed something weird recently, ha uh, recently. For some reason, dust, du the dust doesn't gather under the bed in room 32. Okay. So, a room in the third floor is what I'm getting at here. Okay. 
What is... Oh, okay, so this is like the backyard of this. Okay. Um, alright. I guess I'll explore this later. Since we can't really... We can't actually do anything about that right now. Can actually head down over here. And there's a dead end. Um, yeah, these shy guys will fight you. And they're basically just gonna say that they're doing stuff. Whatever stuff means. You know? But, whatever they're doing, can't get past them for some reason. Alright, so we have, so this is a three-story building. I'm going to go to the third floor first, even though naturally I'm going to, you would explore room two. Uh, but, um, I'm going to explore three, room three first, just because. Um, there, it'll be, it'll make, a, it'll make a little bit more sense just doing that, so. Um, oh! Oh my god! That was bad. Yeah, every once in a while we have these, um, rat enemies right here that you, uh, that you have to, um, take care of. Um, yeah. Alright, let's ha let let's see what's happening in, in 303. Am I feeling something on the table? My beautiful red bird has flown the has flown the coop. Oh, you fixed my bird cage. Thank, thank ever so much. Perhaps my red bird will come back home now. If you see my red bird around, please try to get get it back to 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 get, get it back in its cage. Okay, so I got a bird cage. Okay. All right, so now we can do something about that um or about outside a ghost with a creepy mustache oh it's just mario sorry about that you can not tell anyone i'm slacking off in here are you uh yeah probably not This book was completely blank before, so I couldn't read it, but now I, that, that I can read it, it's actually really, REALLY boring! You call me an old-timer? Alright. Probably not gonna read it, but alright. Tea recipe book? You've been reading a, a- well, no wonder why you're saying it's boring. I mean, unless you're interested in making tea, then that would be helpful, but right now, like, there's probably not any use for that. Huh. Okay. What do I do in this room? I'm like painting this room all over with paints. But... Nothing's happening? Alright, I'm not gonna worry about that right now! <gasps> Woo! Okay. You can jump on those guys, and, you know, your jump does enough power for you to not engage battle with them, so that's cool. Wait, can I move this? Yeah, I can! Whoa, there's a giant hole in the floor! That would be a great place to hide next time I want to nap on the job. Why would you want to do that? Whoa, now I'm like... Now I'm on the second floor. Wait. I can't find them anywhere. I can't see anything without them. Oh, well, problem solved. Look at that. My glasses! I can see for days. I'm off to the party. 
Oops, watch where you're going. Uh, well, at least you broke that for me. So that's good, I guess. Or something. Okay, paint, paint up this spot right here. Why is there a... How come it looks like this? there should be something over here? Wait, but there's a 202 and a 203. Why? Whoa, this thing is moving. I think that's a little creepy if that thing's moving. Ha! It's mine! It's all mine! What did you take? No! It's gone! He stole it! Well, that was, uh, another problem. So there's, like, a bunch of problems here. There's this creepy moving luggage right here. Like, what the heck, man? Okay, so there's a 203 and a 202, but no 201. That's weird. Wasn't this supposed to be 201? Oh! Hey, I wouldn't- I- that's- that's something that you probably never thought- think about, right? Alright, well let's cut up this wall right here. And let's see what- let's see what this gives us here. Whoa, a door is revealed! Ah, how clever! What was that noise just now? Sound like a grandfather clock? Okay, this is creeping me out. A moving luggage. I'm looking for room 201, but I can't seem to find it. Isn't that room 201 over there? Huh? Whoa! Too careful now. You're right! Room 201, how did I miss that? Probably because for some reason it just wasn't there. Thanks to you, I was finally able to check in. But I've got a tea party to get to, so I've got a jet. Ta-ta! Okay. So there's, uh, that's, um... What, the, uh, first problem solved right there. Technically, we have, like, a bunch of other problems that, that, that we solve now. Oh, hey! That was, that was some crazy stuff right there. Holy moly. Alright, well... Um, ooh, hey, color, color spot right here. I hope I didn't miss- I hope I didn't miss that spot, uh, back in, uh, 201 or something, I don't know. Let's go back to the third- to the third floor, because... That, um... That... That 301 room looks- is pretty weird to me. I don't know. Could just be me. I'm gonna go back inside and see and see what we get here. Wait. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on, hold on. That you're a moving phone. That's weird. So all of a sudden, like the room is like all back together or something like that. That's that's super weird. Hello, hello. Can't you hear me? Why don't you answer? Fine, whatever. The service in this hotel stinks. My bed sheets are all wrinkly and creased, so I keep calling the front desk to have them change. But they never seem to answer. It's like they can't even hear my voice. So that's what that mysterious phone call is coming from. I see. Alright, so we need some new blankets. Alright. So, um... So this is the, uh, main objective of this level right here. So, um, there are six of these ghost toads, um, and all six of them are conflicted with a problem. Um, and, uh, there's a very interesting story behind, behind this. If you read the game's manual, which, whoever reads manuals anymore, but, um, way, way long ago... 
when this hotel first opened up. Oh, uh, what the heck is this? Iron your sheets for you, sir. Thanks for doing the job for me, I guess. Alright, we got fresh sheets. Alright, cool. Alright, so we can actually go outside here, too. While we're down here, because might as well. We might as well just clear up the stuff here. Uh, but, um, anyway, um, so, way long ago, when this hotel first opened up, um, there are these six toads. Uh, these six toads, uh, made a promise, an oath, basically, that they were, that when the hotel first opens up, they were going to have a tea party in the hotel at three o'clock, exactly three o'clock. <laughs> However, um, the uh, the uh, grandfather clock broke, uh, and so the toads did not realize that. But then, eventually, they realized that the uh, that because the clock's broken, they can't they can't tell what time it is. Eventually, 3 p.m. passed, and then all six toads, because, you know, they were planning to have a tea party at 3, 3 o'clock, um, they didn't reach the 3 o'clock, and, um, eventually, like, it just, like, they were left in, in deep despair, depression, and, um, and then since then, they just haunted the hotel. Leave this to me, fellas. You got a lot of guts coming here by by yourself, Mario. I like your style. You and me, mano a mano. All right. Very well. All right, Sledge Bro, Shady Sledge Bro, 88 HP with Hammer Attack, which is 30 damage. Hammer Charge Attack, which also is 30 damage. Uh, Quake Attack, which does, and Blowback Attack, which is 80. Uh, so, it's been a while since we've, uh, well, no, no, not, not been a while, but, um, uh, this is, um, another mini-boss fight that we have to defeat, so we're gonna go ahead and defeat him right now. I'm gonna go ahead and use a double jump, as well as a big ol' hammer right here. Let's see how much damage I'm gonna do on this guy. Okay. Seems pretty good. Look at the guys in the back. They're they're like they're panicking every time I hit them. Oh, I beat him first try. Well, well, just in one turn, not first try. There's no such thing as first try. So this is how it ends. If only I could have sat on it just once. Ugh. See ya, boss. RUN FOR YOUR LIVES! So what the heck is this invisible thing? Oh, I saw a star. Is that a paint star you stole, possibly? I bet it's a paint star. Uh, but yeah. Um... And so, then, now, these six toads are conflicted with stuff. Every, as you can tell, every, all, all six of these toads are conflicted with, with some sort of problem. Um, one of them has missing bed sheets, one of them is one of them got something stolen, one of them is missing a book like this guy right here, one of them is, um, ha mi is missing a bird, um, the other one is, uh, was missing, was, can, could not find his hotel room, so... And actually, there are six hotel rooms, so, which means that, you know, one toad per room. I can't believe it all works out that way. I think that's kind of... 
kind of ironic. You know, there's no irony behind it, but... Um, yeah. Alright, let's go back to the third floor, shall we? Uh, so, by the way, uh, earlier when the uh, grandfather clock rang, uh, that actually is a bad sign. Um, and, um... Actually, I'll talk about it later. Uh, right now, I want to see how far I can get with this. My beautiful red bird has flown the coop. Is this the red b bird that you mentioned? I can't believe this is even called a bird. This is a paratrooper. Uh, paratroopers and birds are, like, different. I ain't no stinking Boyd. I know. I, I agree with you. Alright. Let's see what's going on here. Alright. Is this the place? No, it's not the place. Okay, that's next floor. Okay. I'll be able to fall down, because I gotta fall down this floor anyway, so... You know, I, I think it's faster than taking the elevator. Alright, well, here's your bed sheet, sir. <laughs> give a bad review online. Yeah, go on to Yelp. Give this, uh, give the, uh, one star, one star, uh, review on Yelp. Saying, um, uh, saying, uh, this hotel, this hotel service is lousy. I, uh, I try, I, I, I keep having to call them like 20 times to, you know, give me some fresh bed sheets because my, uh, bed, because my old bed sheets suck. They're uncomfortable to sleep on. I try to call them. They can't hear me. Um, and, and I kept calling them. And I, got, I had, like, no response at all. And so, you know, this hotel sucks. Please don't go inside this hotel because your service, is, because their service is not, they're not going to do you any good service. I can just imagine that right now. On, on Yelp. Alright. Okay, so I believe we got one more problem to solve. Uh, well, one more toad to solve. Actually, no. No. I think. I, th I, th I think this is the last one. Yeah, this this, this should this should be the last one. We got it back for you. Okay, what is this thing, anyway? Yes, this is it. Thank you. Oh, but look at the time. I'm going to be late for my tea party. What even is this thing? It's Yoshi? What? You went away! Where'd you go? Yoshi's gone! I can't believe it! Oh. I thought that was a paint star, because it was a star when I picked it up! Ah, uh, alright. So that's all the problems solved, right? Yeah, okay. I'm glad you're here, Mario. These, these guests rented this room for a tea party, but their teapot has gone missing. Could you ask at the front desk if they've seen it around? It has a purple floral, floral pa pattern on it. Okay. Wow, all these toads are mad. Where's our teapot? Hurry, we need the teapot with purple flowers. What is the meaning of this? What's the holdup? I need my tea! We can't have a tea party without a teapot? Yeah, you're, you know, you're right. All right, well, let's ask the front. Oh, I gotta do it quick. Oh, that, that time doesn't look good. A teapot with flowers on it? I feel like I've seen them recently. Hold on. You're just throwing all your stuff in your, out of your storage room just to find it? Man, look at all that mess that you made. Well? 
Sorry, we don't have a purple a purple flower teapot here, but I'm pretty sure I saw one in Plum Park. That's the garden behind the hotel. Sorry, I couldn't be much, much help, but hopefully this mini paint star will raise your spirits. Um, alright, well... Alright then. Missing a spot? Hold on, let me go back and find that. Oh, I have to paint this. Okay. Woo! 100%. Cool. Alright, so um, just a note of reference for that entire level. You are on a timer. Um, and that is that when... You see on the grandfather clock that it hits 3 o'clock. If it hits 3 o'clock, you get kicked out of the entire level and you have to reset the entire level. Every single cutscene, every single paint spot gets reset, every single um, ghost toad um, gets reset as well. So you do not have much time to, to mess around in that level at all. Um, and it makes sense because they, they because the six toads made an oath that uh, at three o'clock they were going to meet up at a tea party. Um, and so because you know you ha are too slow, then it's then the um, the level is 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 um, basically locked in a time loop until you fix the problems, um, which is actually a pretty interesting uh, gimmick in this level. I will say. Anyway, uh, that is going to be it for this episode of Paper Mario Color Splash. Uh, we have to find the these Toad's teapot um, for the Dark Blue Inn in order to fulfill their tea party, uh, which is which we were told is located in Plum Park, and that's where we're headed next time. So, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.